Hey, welcome to Get Growing, a short encouragement to help you pursue God's best in your life. Well, on Sunday, we learned that we're created for worship. We are created to bring God pleasure. Now, maybe you hear that and you think, that's awesome, I can bring God pleasure. I can make him happy through my worship. Or maybe you hear that and you think, okay, well, I understand that worship is important, but I do a lot of other important things besides like singing and reading my Bible and praying. So where do those come in? Well, if you're in that second crew, you need to know that, that worship isn't something that's tied to a specific religious activity. So just listen to what the Apostle Paul wrote in Romans 12, verse 1. He said, Therefore I urge you, brothers and sisters, in view of God's mercy, to offer your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and pleasing to Him. This is your true and proper worship. When the Apostle Paul talks about worship, he's not talking about some specific religious activities. He's, he's talking about surrendering our whole selves to God, offering ourselves as a living sacrifice 24-7, doing whatever we do for God's glory. So that means that whenever we are kind to our neighbor, that's a form of worship. Whenever we work hard, it brings God honor. It's a form of worship. So as a parent, as a spouse, as a child, as a coworker, as a friend, as a neighbor, and everything that we do, we can bring God worship when we do it in a way that's surrendered to Him, the way that He wants us to do that activity. So now, do any of us do that perfectly? I know that I don't, but here's the thing. Following Jesus, it's a journey. It's a process. It's every day getting up and saying, God, whatever I do today, I wanna do it surrendered to you. I wanna do it in a way that brings you honor, however you want me to do it. And so today, whatever it is that you have on your agenda, I encourage you, I challenge you, ask God to help you do it in a way that's surrendered to Him as a sacrifice to Him. And as we do that, we'll find the joy of bringing God pleasure.